It's common practice among fitness enthusiasts to drink a branch chain amino acid supplement during training. However, by doing so and skipping out on the other essential amino acids, are you leaving gains on the table? You bet you are, and that's why on this week's Nutrition Nugget, I'm going to discuss the difference between a branch chain amino acid supplement and choosing a whey protein supplement during training and help you reconsider which one you'll choose next time you head to the gym. Before I begin to sway you as to why you should choose whey protein to sip on during your workout instead of a branch chain amino acid supplement, it's important that I differentiate between the two. The branch chain amino acid term is used to describe a unique set of three amino acids in particular, leucine, isoleucine, and valine. These amino acids are unique because they bypass the liver for digestion and essentially are delivered rapidly to your muscles. So yes, literally chug, bam, in your muscles. <laughs> no, it's not that simple, but hey, it's pretty darn quick. Whey protein, on the other hand, contains all nine essential amino acids. And if you've seen any of my previous nuggets, you know that all nine essential amino acids are crucial for turning on muscle building. Now, the one branch chain amino acid you need to be most familiar with is leucine. That's because leucine is directly responsible for turning on muscle building. Well, it just so happens that whey protein is rich in leucine. In fact, it contains more leucine per gram than any other protein source out there. The goal of drinking an amino acid supplement during your training is to help provide a protective layer across your muscles to minimize muscle protein breakdown. In essence, this helps you to recover quicker and ultimately build more muscle. There's also some research to show that it may help reduce your rating of, or your perceived fatigue, ultimately allowing you to train harder. However, what we really want to differentiate is just those three amino acids versus the complete set of nine essential amino acids found in your whey protein. Now, as I mentioned earlier, leucine is responsible for triggering muscle protein synthesis or muscle building. However, there's some research to show that even when leucine remains elevated after drinking an essential or a branch chain amino acid supplement, Muscle building still goes down after a couple hours. So when leucine's still up here, muscle protein synthesis has gone up and already gone back down. And in fact, we do actually have some research to show that there is more than leucine in play when it comes to turning on muscle building and keeping it stimulated. For instance, a study done in rats fed the rats either just amino acid supplements or a complete whey protein supplement. And what the researchers found was a not only a higher peak in muscle protein synthesis levels, but also a longer duration. Furthermore, a study actually done in humans, yes, humans, though it's worth mentioning, and this is notable, and I'll come back to it why in a minute, it was done in an elderly population. And what researchers did was split them into two groups and feed one of the groups an essential amino acid supplement. So this actually had all nine essential amino acids and the other group consumed a whey protein, which also has nine essential amino acids, and then some. And what the researchers found was that the group consuming the whey protein was able to maintain a more positive net protein balance. In layman's terms, their body was building more proteins than it was breaking down. That is what you were all striving for, myself included. Now, that elderly population tidbit is noteworthy because as we age, we become more resistant to leucine. And that means we need to have even more protein to have the same effect on muscle building. And the fact that this elderly population responded so well to the whey protein, well, hey, that's a good sign. That means we're on to something. There are several bioactive compounds found in whey. And yes, again, if you've been following any of my nuggets, you know there's already some that I've highlighted that help suppress your appetite. But another one, specifically referred to as exosomes, have been shown to have a positive impact on the peak of muscle building as well as the duration after someone is being fed whey protein. Now, this type of research is in its infancy, and out of the Molecular Science and Applied Science Laboratory at the University of Auburn, there is research being shown that in petri dishes, I must point out, however, that these exosomes on their own, separate from the whey protein, 
actually stimulate muscle building and extend the duration that it's stimulated for. And that is just mind-blowing and awesome. So what I am recapping and summarizing for you is whey protein, rich in all nine essential amino acids, particularly leucine, also contains bioactive compounds that further work to stimulate muscle building. So now we have multiple variables coming into play to stimulate muscle building and keep it stimulated so you can recover quicker and make greater gains. Now, this is all very new research and we're talking comparative to branch chain amino acid supplement. Does it really matter? Well, I'll let you be the judge, but I'll tell you what, Given the fact that building muscle is challenging in the first place, and only gets harder as we get older, I'm gonna take every one or two percent tidbit I can get to enhance my success in building muscle. Thanks for watching everyone. Make sure you tag a friend who's struggling to make gains, or someone who should consider drinking a whey protein supplement during training versus a branch chain amino acid supplement. And guess what? The best way to drink it is to mix that chocolate whey protein with a red or fruit punch Gatorade. Mmm! It tastes like a red Tootsie Pop. It can't be beat. And as always, follow me on social media. Check out nutritiontactician.com. Get your free ebook of how eating more protein can help you lose more weight. Train hard, eat well, and I'll see you next time.